my name is Simon. I've been working with lighting here at Hirschsprung. Then I noticed a very beautiful painting, which I think recalls a beautiful summer night and maybe also a light you can see in the paintings in here. This summer night in the middle of the night where these clouds, nightlit clouds, suddenly start shining in the sky. They aren't normal clouds hanging there. They are at a height of 80 kilometers and we still don't know why they're there. And a light nerd like me loves looking at that sort of thing and exploring it, here but also at night at home. The funny thing, in fact, and this picture is from 1888, is that at that time there was also someone who paid attention to these clouds and painted them. So I'm pretty sure that the man who painted this painting was also a pretty big light nerd. Or a passionate light man, you could say, just like I am. There are also small subtleties here in the very blue and cold shades that merge into some slightly warmer shades that you can actually scan for yourself in the middle of the night. There's a small lake that lights up down there very, very delicately, even though the sun has gone down a long time ago. Then the landscape is suddenly painted up in a different way. It's like a magical scent hanging over the landscape below. It isn't all black, it isn't just shadows, there's a tiny bit of green in it. And it's a little bit dusty in the colors, as if there was a thin veil of bog wife brew over it. So you can also smell the landscape it comes from. There's so much calmness in this painting, a sort of Danish landscape calmness. It probably couldn't be done in many other places in the world. It's rather unique to the Danish landscape, the simplicity that's in it. And I think that's magical. So I just think you should get on board in this painting and imagine this romantic summer night and then let yourself be drawn into it.